Hi my friends, today I'm going to show you how to make a lovely raspberry coolie. So let's get started my friends. So I, uh, I'm going to grab my raspberry now. It's nice and easy to make, amazing. So sit back, listen and enjoy. Thank you very much. Please be sure to like, share, subscribe and of course share on social media. WhatsApp, lots of social media, Facebook and all that. I'm gonna make in the next 30 minutes, I'm gonna make our lovely Barbara. So sit back, relax and enjoy. Thank you very much. So my friends, I have my raspberry here, so I'll be making barawa in the next uh, 30 minutes. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to weigh out my ingredient now. So my friends, I need 250 grams of raspberry, so I'm going to weigh out my raspberry now, quickly. It's nice and easy to make, my friends, amazing. So I'm going to weigh out uh, one, uh, 250 grams of raspberry straight into this lovely bowl. So I'm using the frozen raspberry. So I have 250 grams of frozen raspberry. So I'm going to set that aside quickly. That's 250 grams, my friends. So now my friends, what I'm going to do, I have my lovely raspberry ready, 250 grams of frozen raspberry. So as I said before, I'm, we are making this. This is a lovely raspberry coolie. So that's what we're making. So I have that. I already made that before. So I'm going to make a new one now for you to see my friends. I'm going to pop that in the fridge. So now, my friends, what I'm going to do, I'm going to quickly weigh out my ingredient. I already weigh out that I have 75 grams of sugar, of caster sugar. And of course, I need my lovely water. So I'm going to weigh out uh, 60, yes, 67 grams of water. That's all right. So I'm going to set that aside. Now, my friends, I'm going to bring my water and sugar to the boy. It's nice and easy to make, my friends. Amazing. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to quickly pop my sugar into my lovely saucepan. So I'm going to dissolve my sugar and water together on high heat. Look at that, my friends. Amazing. That's the water and sugar. So I'm going to pop that on the hob. So I'm going to bring that to the boy quickly. So what I'm going to do now, my friends, I'm gonna quickly move my camera close to the hub so you see what I'm doing. So uh, I'm gonna pop that. That's that's the uh, the raspberry. That's the raspberry. 
and that's the water and you know it's been brought to the boy the water and sugar so we leave that to heat up for some time nice and easy my friends amazing so i'm going to pop that one here so you can see nice and easy my friends no worries I want it nice and easy. So, my friends, we did that on high heat. You can see. So, I'm going to do, I'm going to adjust my camera quickly. So that's on high heat. So you can see, my friends, we have sugar and water right into this lovely saucepan. Nice and easy, my friends. Amazing. So now we have our water and sugar ready. So I'm, I'm making a syrup. That's a lovely syrup. So now I'm gonna do, my friends. I'm gonna pop in my lovely raspberry frozen raspberry into this lovely um saucepan so i'm going to break that on on low heat on low heat my friends You can see the raspberry, the frozen raspberry is already melting. You can see that my friends, nice and easy my friends, amazing. So my friends, please be sure to join the next live stream. I will be making a lovely babawa. I will be making a lovely um, babawa pudding recipe. It's gonna be nice and sensational, my friends. So, uh, I have that already melting, so I'll leave that for some time. Very lovely, my friends. Nice and easy to make, no worries. I love the aroma of frozen raspberries, really nice. Lovely. So we'll leave that for some time, my friends. Nice and easy, my friends. Amazing. So we're going to keep an eye on that. We want that to melt. Of course, we don't want it to, um, to be very hot. We want you know, low heat at this time. Nice and easy, my friends. No worries. Amazing. We're almost there, my friends. So now, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna check if they are already melting. Yeah, we can see some of the raspberries melting. Lovely raspberries. This is gonna be a lovely cookie. Same way you make your raspberry coolie, it's the same way you make your mango coolie, the strawberry coolie, blueberry coolie, blackberry coolie, you know, same way my friends. First of all, you need to make your syrup. When you make your syrup, of course, you can go ahead to make your lovely coolie. So our uh, coolie is almost ready. The raspberries are melting. So now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna turn off, turn off my heat. It's already melting. So this is on low heat now. 
Same way you make your raspberry coolie, the same way you make your mango coolie, your strawberry coolie, you know. It's almost ready, my friends. Be sure to like, share, subscribe. Share on WhatsApp, share on Facebook, share on Instagram, share on um, Twitter. Every social media, my friends, share my videos. And be sure to join the next live stream. I'm going to be making a lovely pudding. I'm going to show you what I'm going to be making in the next live stream. So in the next live stream, in 30 minutes, after this, probably in 20 minutes, I'm going to be making a lovely pudding with this lovely raspberry coolie. So I'm going to, I'm going to be using the raspberry coolie to make this lovely raspberry babawa so make sure you be sure to join the next live stream in the next 15 minutes we're gonna be done in the next 10 minutes and in 15 minutes i'm gonna start another lovely live stream to make this lovely pudding so sit back plus and enjoy my friends thank you very much be sure to subscribe share like on social medias you know i make quality videos So now my friends, we have our lovely, you know, raspberry coolie almost ready. So what I'm gonna do, I'm, I'm gonna allow that to cool down for some time. And of course, you can use the thermal mix. My friends, when using your thermal mix, you can blend your lovely, you know, syrup and raspberry into your lovely thermal mix because the thermal mix is super strong so you can use that well my friends if you're using your normal blender please make sure your ladder to cool down a little bit so when it cools down a little bit then of course you can pop into your blender and of course blend that and i'm going to show you the next thing to do and you're going to see our lovely coolie i already made one earlier i'm going to show you our lovely coolie i made earlier on my friends So my friends, that's the lovely coolie I made earlier on. This is the lovely raspberry coolie. You can see that I'm gonna show you how I did that. You know, when you're making your plating, lovely. And you can put your strawberries or whatever, your blueberries, you know, on your lovely plate. So my friends, that's the lovely coolie. So I'm gonna set that aside for you to see. And of course, I'm gonna make another one. And of course, we're on that now. So I'm gonna keep an eye on that. I'll allow that to cool down in the next uh, two minutes. I'm going to blend that in my blender. Look at that lovely color. It looks absolutely amazing. Nice and easy, my friends, to make amazing. So now, my friends, what I'm going to do, I'm going to push my camera back and, of course, start to blend my lovely coolie. It's nice and easy to make, my friends. No worries. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. Thank you very much. So now, my friends, what I'm going to do, I'm going to quickly pop my lovely coolie into this lovely blender. So I'm going to blend that straight away so we can have our lovely coolie. So as I said before, be sure to join the next live stream. Of course, you don't want to miss that. I'm going to be using my lovely, you know, pudding pots to make my lovely, you know, babawa pudding or babawa, you know, pudding recipe or raspberry babawa. So I'm going to be using that lovely, you know, raspberry coolie to make a lovely raspberry Babawa. So sit back, relax and enjoy my friends and be sure to subscribe, like, share and of course, you know, share on social medias, you know, because when I'm making a live stream, I make quality live stream and of course, this is for real and I'm going to repeat the recipe again, I'm using 125 grams of, I beg your pardon, I'm using 250 grams of raspberry, 250 grams of frozen raspberry and 
I made a syrup. I made a sugar syrup from 75 grams of sugar and 60, um, 67 grams of water. So what I did, you know, I mix my water and sugar together in a saucepan and pop it on the hob and I brought that to the boy on high heat and after that I pop my lovely raspberry, frozen raspberry into my lovely sauce and now I have a lovely colorful raspberry sauce. So what I'm going to do now my friends, I'm going to quickly pop that into my lovely blender. So I'm going to blend that. You know, for a few minutes quickly because I'm gonna quickly make my next live stream I don't wanna waste time so I'm gonna pop that one now quickly so I'll be right back in the next two minutes because I want that to cool down and of course I'm gonna blend that quickly that's a lovely uh, raspberry you know cooling that made earlier on so just a second, my friends. Thank you very much. So now my friends, uh, I'm going to pop that straight into the lovely blender. Uh, because this is uh, really hot. Anyway, it's not hot anymore. So I'm going to pop that in gently. So I'm going to show you. Lovely. Look at that, my friends. Amazing. Lovely cooling. Nice and easy to make, my friends. No worries. So now, what I'm going to do I'm going to quickly blend my raspberries I'm going to set that aside that's the one I made earlier on so now my friends I'm going to show you our lovely cooling it's nice and easy to make my friends so now I have my lovely coolie ready so I'm gonna blend that quickly I'm gonna set that aside put that away I don't need anymore so now my friends I'm gonna blend that quickly it's nice and easy to make my friends amazing I'm gonna blend that again. You can see that my friends, it's nice and easy to make. I'm gonna blend that again.
that's it my friends so now my friends what i'm gonna do i'm gonna show you how to make our lovely coolie so now my friends i'm gonna you know strain my lovely coolie straight into this lovely bowl uh what i'm gonna do i'm gonna strain that into that bowl I'm making it very thick really. very nice so I'm gonna sip that quickly I'm gonna strain that into this lovely strainer it's very lovely lovely tastes really nice Nice and easy to make, my friends. Amazing! Look at that, my friends. Lovely raspberry coolie. I told you, my friends, you can make it the same way as your mango coolie, blackberry coolie, blueberry coolie, or your fruit coolie are made the same way, my friends. All you need to do is to make your syrup, and after that, you go ahead to pop in your lovely fruit into your lovely syrup. Blend it and of course sieve it and your lovely coolie is ready. You're never gonna buy coolie anymore. Nice and easy to make my friends. Amazing. Look at that my friends. Lovely. That's it. Very thick coolie. Amazing recipe. So when you strain your coolie, the seeds from the raspberry will be left in your strainer and you need to get rid of that you don't want to use that so I'm going to show you after straining you're going to find some seeds left in the strainer look at that you don't want to use that isn't it so I'm going to get rid of that so now my friends I'm going to show you our lovely raspberry coolie nice and thick nice and easy to make amazing look at that my friend lovely raspberry coolie so i'm gonna pop that into my lovely glass amazing lovely my friends look at that amazing lovely I love coolie. So my friends, if you like, you can have your coolie as a drink or I'm going to show you how to plate it. So it's nice and easy my friends, no worries. So now I'm going to show you how to plate your coolie. So my friends, remember to share, like, you know, subscribe, share on social media, and if you want to watch the video again, because it's going to take some time, when you make a live stream, it takes some time to upload, to show on my channel, so what you need to do, my friends, if you want to rewatch my lovely video, you can check out my playlist, my live stream playlist, or dessert playlist, you're going to find my lovely coolie. You check my coffee drink playlist or my live stream playlist. You're gonna find that lovely coolie right there. You can rewatch that, share it, and give it a like. My friends, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you how to do that. It's nice and easy to make, my friends. Amazing. So I'm gonna show you now. Easy, my friends. So and don't forget, my friends. To join me in 15 minutes, 10 15 minutes for my lovely live stream is gonna be on how to make raspberry babawa. So, 
I'm gonna grab that nice and easy. I'm gonna hold that there. That's it, my friend. And you can fold that one there. You can put your mango coolie or whatever on that. You know what I mean, my friends. Nice and easy, my friends. Amazing. I'm going to grab my raspberries. So, my friends, I could just pop that one there. You know. You can pop more raspberries. You can put blueberries or whatever. Easy. So my friends, you can see that was the one I made earlier on and that's the one I just made now on my lovely live stream. So thank you very much my friends for watching this lovely live stream. See you in the next 10 minutes for another lovely live stream on how to make babawa. Thank you very much. My name is Francis and this is Fuku Chef Francis live on YouTube, making it real on YouTube. See you in 10 minutes. Bye-bye, my friends. Cheers. Bye-bye.